I'm Ali Aradi, the CTO of Panologic, and I'm here to tell you about the Pano device today. Um, the Pano device is a very uh, interesting and unique piece of hardware, which I'm going to show you uh, later on. But it's a, uh, it's a pure piece of hardware that you plug uh, into your desktop and uh, plug at your desktop and replace your PC. So all those PCs and all those thin clients you have sitting on the desktop that are running, running lots of software that have to be managed, you throw those out and replace it with a pure piece of hardware. The Pano device is really, really unique in that it doesn't run any software. It's a pure hardware device. So the way to think of this is if you had a piece of hardware that you plugged into your PC, into the USB port or into the PCI bus, you normally have to load drivers to make that, that piece of hardware work in the PC. Well, the Pano device is the same way. It's a pure piece of hardware, and you run drivers in Windows XP running in the data center to make the device work. And so if you go into the Windows Device Manager, um, you'll see the Panologic Display Adapter Driver, you'll see the Panologic USB Driver, you'll see the Panologic Audio Driver. And what these do is they lead Windows to believe that the Pano device, um, that all the ports on the back of the Pano device are local ports for, uh, for Windows. And so when you plug a USB device into the back of the Pano, Windows goes and loads standard drivers, and that device, that USB device, works the way it normally would on a regular PC.